Hi there, Heap here. Today we will be taking our Risk Five build, plugging it in, and having some first thoughts. But first, what did we have last time? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Done. If that was cool, don't forget to overflow the like button and help me reach negative 2.147 billion likes. You know how it goes, it first has to go past 2.147 billion likes. And with that out of the way, let's get started. So, good ink. I'll leave you on the side for a bit. Let's spin this for a test ride, shall we? So what we need first is... NOS to boot from. Ooh. You're provided with a FUSDK. I don't know what it's called. Freedom Unleashed SDK or something like that. And it's an SD card with an OS that runs XFCE. So, I can tell this is a developer machine, but I didn't bend in the COM part. Well, you'll go this way then. <laughs> Anyways, we need to plug in the graphics card into the port. Right. And we need power. That power switch is satisfying. So, we've got ink back up. What we need is this cable. This cable is, well, it's a single micro USB UART cable that we're going to use for serial debugging. It's like serial killers. We will plug it into the exact port I didn't plug it in. Well, the exact port I didn't bend in. And now, what we should be able is follow the docks. Let's try this one. Oh, look at that. Hey. It did get the image, it boosts the kernel, right? Haha! -ha. So we've got boot. Welcome to Freedom USDK. Nice! Look at that! Oh! <laughs> we got actual thing! Isn't that cool? Okay. Okay, so it's not the fastest thing. What is it? What is the password? Root sci five. What? Ah. We've got the thing. We've got desktop. Here we go. Look at that. All right, so let me just plug in my mouse and see if it explodes or not. Okay, nice. We've got notes. Ooh, drag. Did it just lag itself on drag? Wait, I, I saw our mouse go red. Yeah. Okay, so I can move the mouse around. 
I can move it like so. Can I drag? Yeah! Okay, so there's no V-Sync, or maybe it's just... ...thing being wrong. Oh! It died again! So, LSPCI. Let's go. Driver News AMD GPU. This is really awesome. So, we've got... Wait! Look at this. Is this a big bar? Is this an 8 gigabyte bar? Or something? No way. LSCPU RISC 5 64 Little Endian 4 cores with 2 megs of LT cache, 32k cache. Like, for example, LSCPU. Okay, so we've got XCD664. Um, little Endian. You've got 32 CPUs. What what else? Uh, the cache, the cache sizes. So, yeah. L2 is 8 megs on. AMD. It's also got an L3. It's got a much bigger L1 data and instruction cache but you know uh those are the things that's a, that's the difference like this is this right here if i can oh this right here is got like it's a tsmc 28 nanometer i believe so it's not you know the the best in class but that's not the point of this machine that's not the point like it's a developer machine risk five is like fairly new they they, they like created the architecture in like university like 10 years ago or something and like it's gaining traction because of how attractive the business model is and uh, while we have apple waging war on x86 with our machines and arm is finally catching up on desktop we've also got risk 5 which give it 10 more years and it could be a very very viable thing because it's much more open than ARM and especially if you've got something like NVIDIA purchasing ARM uh, RISC-V will become even more attractive. Alright, so yeah this was the first look at the most powerful RISC-V development board ever. It runs fine we had to go through hoops uh, the build was a total disaster, but I think it was worth it. I will probably learn some assembly whenever I'm slightly free. Expect a review sometime, sometime. Emphasis on sometime, but the future is exciting, to say the least. We'll have a look how it works, how it goes. What are the, what are the differences from X86? And what's the future look, gonna look like? If you liked the video, don't forget to overflow the like button for the YouTube algorithm and hit subscribe for more content like this. Don't forget, my name was Heap, yours was undefined. See ya. <laughs>